guys, welcome again to my channel DNA.12 Education. Students, today we are going to discuss a new topic in mathematics. The topic is inequality. This video is presented by DNA.12 Education. Cambridge Pass IDCSC O level at Excel at International Baccalaureate Test Preparation in Series Neopolitics Part 1. So, what is inequality, student? The symbol are inequality symbols or the relations and are used to show the relative sizes of the values of the numbers. Okay, so then how to read the symbols? Okay, this is the first. We can read the symbol by less than. The second one, you can read Greater than. For instance, C less than D. You can read C is less than D. Okay, students, the next symbol for you. Yeah. We can read less than and equal. Okay. Greater than and equal. For instance, C is greater than D. C is greater than and equal to D. Once again, C is greater than and equal to D. So what about this symbol? Okay, you can read X is greater than a and x is less than b students for this special symbol you have to read from the middle to the left and from the middle to the right once again x is greater than a and x is less than b Okay, so this is the second how to read this one. You have to read from the, from the middle, the left, and one more, you have to read from the middle to the right. So, X is greater than A, and X is less than B. Is it clear? Once again, X is greater than A, and X is less than B. Is it clear, everyone? Okay, go. For instance, okay, you can read x is greater than minus 2 and x is less than 3 once again x is greater than minus 2 and x is less than 3 students you have to read this symbol from the middle to the left and from the middle to the right X 
is greater than minus 2 and x is less than 3. x is less than sorry x is greater than minus 2 and x is less than 3 clear x is greater than minus 2 and x is less than 3. Is it clear, everyone? Okay, go. Okay, think about this. The symbol or inequality symbols indicate that the endpoints are included in the solution set. For example, this one x is greater and equal minus 4 and x less than 4. Once again, x is greater than minus 4 and x is less than 4 x is greater than minus 4 and x is less than 4 We can represent these inequalities on number line below. Okay. Okay, so that. So that x is greater than minus 4 and x less than 4. For the minus 4, we can find the full circle, but for the right side, is empty circle. For the left side, is full circle. But for the right side is empty circle. Students, full circle means minus four or minus four is included in the solution set. Once again, minus four is included. in the solution set. But empty circle means 4 is not included in the solution set. Is it clear, everyone? Good, thank you. Next. So, how about this one? X is greater than minus 4 and X less than and equal 4. X is greater than minus 4 and X less than and equal to 4. So with this diagram on number line.
You understand so no? So on this on this number line, we found that minus four is empty symptom. But four is full symbol. What does it mean? Empty circle means mean minus four is not included in the solution set. So what is the meaning full circle? Mean four is included in the solution set. Is it clear everyone? Good. You go to the next topic. Grabbing the inequalities on number line. The inequalities can be represented on number line below. Look at the symbol. X is less than 5. X is less than 5 means the direction the left side. Okay, look the representation of x less than 5 on number line. Okay, this is the symbol x less than 5. Or we can represent x less than 5 on number line below. Okay, go to the next example. X less than and equal 5. X less than and equal 5. Take a look to the representation of this X less than and equal 5 on number line. Okay. Or... Okay, is it clear everyone? Students, for the symbol less than or less than and equal, we can find the difference for both as below sign. This is the symbol of less than. Right? But this is the symbol of less than and equal. Is it over one? Or empty circle. Empty circle is the symbol of less than but full circle is the symbol of less than and equal the clear one very good next So what about x is greater than minus 2? Oh, this is the representation. To the right side. Greater than or more than the direction will go to the right side. So 
So what about this one? X is greater than and equal minus 4 and X is less than 5. X is greater than and equal minus 4 and X less than 5. This is the representation. Good. Students, look at this symbol. Right? So the symbol is sung by this full circle. Clear? Well, what about this less than five? Less than is symbolized by empty circle. Clear everyone? Okay, good. Avoid the negative variable for the last answer. If an inequality is multiplied or divided by a negative number, the result will be unequal in the opposite order. Once again, if an inequality is multiplied or divided by a negative number, the result will be unequal in the opposite order. Before the final answer, make sure you answer in positive order. Before final answer, make sure you answer in positive order. For example, Minus x less than 4. Minus x less than 4. Avoid the negative variable for the last answer. Okay, students, so you can multiply by minus 1 for both sides, left and right. And you'll find x is greater than minus 4. Okay, so then I'll show you the process. This is the process. Minus x less than 4. And both sides times by minus 1. Times by minus 1. Or multiply by minus 1. Okay. Minus by minus one. For both sides will be multiplied by minus one. Left side will be positive x. Right side will be negative four. And for the symbol of inequality, one, it will be opposite order. It will be opposite order. Is it clear, one? Good. Next. Okay, students, I want to give you tips and tricks to solve this inequality. I want to give you tips and tricks to solve inequality. Eliminate fractions by multiplying all terms by the least common denominator of all fractions. 
We call this one LCM. Simplify by combining like terms on each side of the inequality. Follow the rules of algebra. Very simple. Follow the rules of algebra. And the last, at the last, avoid the negative variable by multiplying or dividing inequalities by minus one. Declare rule one. There are four tips and tricks to solve inequalities. Okay, students, go to the example one. Solve and draw these inequalities on number one. 2x plus 6 less than minus 2 open the bracket x plus 1. Answer. Okay, go. 2x plus 6 less than minus 2 open the bracket x plus 1. You can simply find and expand. 2x plus 6 less than minus 2x minus 2. Is it level 1? Okay, I will show you the process. Minus 2x. Minus 2 times 1 is minus 2. Is it clear? I'm on? Good. Go. plus 2x less than minus 2 minus 6. Is it level 1? Okay, so then we have to follow the algebra operation. This is the rule of algebra, right? So minus 2x will go to the left side. And it will be positive, right? Because here is negative. Right? Is it level 1? But 6 will go to the right side. 6 is positive here. So when 6 is going to the right side, it will be negative here. The clear one? Good. Go. Okay, we found 4x less than minus 8. And of course, x less than minus 2. Right. Now we go to number line. We're going to present this answer on number line. Look at the diagram below. x less than minus 2 on number line. Oh, here we go. This is the answer. Yeah, is it level 1? X less than minus 2. Minus 2 is not included in the set. Answer. Or, this is the diagram. Okay, good. Is it level 1? Okay, go to the example two. Example two. Solve and draw these inequalities on number line. X plus two more than or greater or greater than an equal minus three. And two over the bracket x minus three is less than minus four. Once again. X plus 2 is greater than and equal minus 3 and 2 open the bracket. X minus 3 close the bracket less than minus 4. Students, we have two inequalities based on the question, right? Okay, go to the answer. For the first, X plus 2 is greater than and equal minus 3. By using the algebra, 2 will go to the right side and it will be x 
is greater than and equal minus 5. This is number 1. I will show you the process. This is the process. 2, you go to the right side. Alright? So x is greater than minus 3, minus 2. So x is greater than minus 5. Right? Good. Next. So the second is. Two open the bracket x minus three plus the bracket less than minus four. But you should know algebra. We found x less than one. Is it clear? Okay, students, I'll show you the process. Here we are. Two times x is two x. Two times minus three is minus 6 less than minus 4 2x less than minus 4 minus 6 will go to the right side here is it and it will be positive 6 right so 2x less than 2x less than 1 is it number 1 Good. Okay, so we have to answer. X is greater than and equal when it's 5. And X is less than 1. So what about the representation on number 1? Very easy, students. X is greater than and equal when it's 5. And X is less than 1 on number line. Here we are. Hmm. Good. Once again. Oh, is it number one? Okay, I'll show you what's the meaning. Look at the symbol. It's circle, right? Is it right? Minus five is included in number set but here empty circle empty circle right there here the empty circle means one is not included with the empty set is it clear one Okay, go. I'll show you the next example. Here we are, example three. Solve and draw these inequalities on number line. Whoa! Three, open the bracket, x plus two plus the bracket of four is greater than and equal minus three plus x minus seven over two. Okay, students, I'll show you how to solve these inequalities. So then, for the first is find, find the LCM. Find the LCM. Do you understand the LCM? Good. The LCM or denominator. Students, we have denominator here. There are four and two. Right? Is it clear? Four and two. So the LCM of four and two is the LCM. Ah, uh, four and two is four, right? Good. 
Because the LSM is, is 4, we have to multiply for both sides by 4. We have to multiply both sides by 4. Okay? Okay. 3. Open the bracket. X plus 2. Close the bracket. Over 4. Greater than equal. Minus. Plus X minus 7 over 2. For both sides, will be multiplied by 4. 4. 4. And 4. For both sides, right? Multiply by 4. Multiply by by 4. Okay, so then, go to the simplification. Cancel. Right. Cancel. You got to here. Okay, so then, go. 3. I'm going to break it. X plus 2 is greater than an equal minus that's right 12 plus x minus 7 times 2 next 3x plus 6 is greater than an equal minus 12 Plus here two x x times two to x and here minus seven times two is minus fourteen. Okay, so let's go. The x six is greater than equal here. Hmm. Minus. 26, right? Plus 2x. Okay, so let's go. Using the algebra. So x will go to the left side. And 6 will go to the right side. Right? Next. 3x minus 2x. It's greater than and equal minus 26 minus 6. 3x minus 2x is x. It's greater than equal minus 32. Okay? So this is the final answer. You get to that? This is the final answer, right? So. How to represent this inequalities on number line? On number line. Very easy. On number line. Very easy, student. Go. Number line here. Okay, and then minus 32 32 is here minus 32 greater than equal minus 32 so the answer is And then the direction is right. So 
Oh, he is answer. X is greater than and equal minus 30. Okay, so done? Very clear and very easy, right? Okay, thank you. Now we go to the practice. So that's thank you for attention for watching my video. See you at the next topic, Inequalities Part 2. Bye-bye. January 2020 with Mr. Jasper as my course tutor. Mr. Jasper did not only teach me the proper techniques of both math and mathematica, but he teach me how to learn independently and how to stick into a problem to find ways of solving it. The course materials were good and it's based on my school curriculum and the mentor approaching is also good. During the pandemic of COVID-19, we studied via the internet and it's also good. And I think Mr. Jasper is very good and it's a solid course. I learned a lot. Thanks, sir. Hi, nama saya Cassius Nathanael. Saya adalah seorang siswa kelas 6 SD Penabur Harapan Indah Bekasi. Les di Bimbo QPC sangat menyenangkan karena Konsepnya fun learning, cara mengajarnya pun asik dan tidak membosankan. Selama les di Bimbo QPC, saya menjadi lebih mudah untuk mengerjakan soal-soal matematika. Karena di sini, kita akan diberikan rumus-rumus jitu yang mudah dipelajari. Oke, salam. Halo, salam pelajar. Nama saya Pascal Clayton. Saya siswa Kolese Kanisius, angkatan 21. Saya di sini untuk memberi testimoni saya mengenai proses belajar saya di QPC selama masa karantina lockdown ini. Pertama, eh, jelas, belajarnya jadi lebih susah karena harus belajar online. Namun, saya berterima kasih mempunyai QPC untuk membimbing saya eh, melewati eh, perjalanan belajar online saya. Saya sama sekali eh, belum familiar dengan proses belajar online. Saya sangat perlu bimbingan dan uh, saya berterima kasih akan uh, adanya QPC di situ untuk membimbing saya. Nilai saya pun uh, akhirnya berhasil kekejar. Nilai saya yang 60-60 menjadi nilai 80-80 dan nilai saya yang yang 80 menjadi nilai 90. Uh, itu adalah pelajaran mata pelajaran IPA tuh. Jadi uh, selama proses belajar online ini. Akhirnya kekejar juga nilai saya uh, Itu in part sangat besar karena uh, Bimbingan Sir Jasper uh, Dan QPC Setiap malam uh, Kami belajar bersama Untuk mempersiapkan diri untuk esok pagi uh, Belajar online uh, Jadi uh, Nilainya aman Sama belajar online ini di QPC um, Semuanya aman dan bahkan uh, lebih meningkat kalau di uh, kasus saya. Sekian dari saya, uh, terima kasih. Salam pelajar.